Theobald Wolftone was born in Dublin, Ireland in 1763 to a family of Protestant Anglo-Irish descent. He attended Trinity College Dublin and was admitted to the Irish Bar in 1789. Tone became involved in politics and was elected to the Irish House of Commons in 1783. However, he quickly became disillusioned with the British government's treatment of Ireland and began to advocate for Irish independence. In 1791, Tone founded the Society of United Irishmen, which aimed to unite Catholics and Protestants in the cause of Irish independence. The organization rapidly grew in popularity and by 1798, it was planning a rebellion against British rule. Tone traveled to France in 1796 to seek support for the rebellion, and he was successful in persuading the French government to send troops and supplies to Ireland. However, the rebellion was poorly organized and was quickly crushed by British forces. Tone was captured by the British and was sentenced to be hanged, but he was allowed to commit suicide by slitting his own throat. Tone was not only a political activist but also a gifted writer. He wrote numerous articles and pamphlets advocating for Irish independence and outlining his vision for a united Ireland. His most famous work is the Argument on Behalf of the Catholics of Ireland, which argued for the equal rights of Catholics and Protestants. Tone's legacy as a revolutionary and patriot has continued to inspire Irish nationalists and republicans. He is remembered as a key figure in the struggle for Irish independence and as one of the first advocates of a united and independent Ireland that would be free from British rule. He is also seen as a symbol of the shared heritage and aspirations of Catholics and Protestants in Ireland.